Matt, that was uh, certainly an interesting game today. Game of kind of a bit of two halves. Dorchester came back to it in the second half. The last minute penalty saved to win it. What was your what was your thoughts? Yeah, I think you hit the nail on the head. A bit cliche, but yeah, it was a game of two halves. But first half we dominated and we were very very good. The second half we dropped our standards a little bit and they grew into the game. They um, you know, a really good crowd here as well, which which got on the back of them, which was great for them. Uh, but yeah, we just there was key moments in the game where we were a little bit sloppy. I felt, and um, you know, when I watch it back tomorrow, I'd probably I'll probably agree with my own opinion on that and staff's opinion. So I think we we need to be better, uh, of course, over the course of the 90 minutes. We can't just perform really well for 45 and then let our standards drop. It's about having that consistency throughout. I ask for consistency in in games, and now I feel as if we need consistency over the 90 minutes. And I feel as if um, you know, today first half was great. Second half we dropped a little bit. Great team goal for the first goal. Toby uh, with a, had a bit. There was a lot of good build-up. Like, kind of seen that against Harrow. Really, how important so is it that you work on the build-up play in training? Yeah, really important. There's stuff that we do regularly. Uh, as long as there's no games in midweek, we, we we work quite a lot on that kind of stuff in and, in and around the box. Uh, you know, defenders stepping out, starting to attack from the defence, and then having our link play up front. So it's something that we we do tend to work on. And like I said, especially first half today, you could see the combination play was really really good. Um, you know, on another day we score, you know, we score a key time, and then the game's three 0 and then the game's uh, over. But as you saw, and you know, this is why I just said then this is why football's the best best game in the world because you know the the mixture of emotions today. Was was intense, and I could quite easily be here with a, a sad face, saying that you know it feels like a loss, but um, but we're not. We're you know we're positive. It's another point to where it's another three points to where we want to get to. Um, so yeah, it's a, it's a happy dressing room. Yeah, and the penalty at the end was kind of you saw kind of in the crowd we were deflated, and it was a little bit uh, here we go again kind of thing. It happens, but um, I don't think I've ever seen a <laughs> for a safe penalty. Certainly not in. All the years I've been going to pool. Um, Lloyd Thomas must kind of feel like he's got a little bit one on, given the history that's here. We kind of said the other day that it was going to be a little bit of a, an extra thing to today. How how professional has he been? I mean, he's more than capable of playing at this level. You know, and you saw today he's um, you know he pulled off a fantastic penalty save. You know, later on in the game, and you know we've all congratulated him. It was great to see so much emotion from you at full time as well. Haven't seen a celebration like that since that since the door. Uh, Doncaster Golf, so well done. Cheers. Thanks. Thank you so much. Um, and Merry Christmas and six points from six. Absolutely. Thank you Cheers, very much. Mate. Take care.